Hey guys, what is up? In this video, I'm gonna show you the easiest thing in the world to do, but it's something that I get asked actually quite a bit, is how do you share files between Mac computers? It's actually really easy to do, and I'm surprised as to how many people don't know how to do this. Um, so I've got uh, two Macs in my house, and one is my Mac Pro, which is what I'm currently recording this on, but I also have a Mac book, which is actually in a completely different room. Someone's actually borrowing it real quick, um, working on a video, but I need to pull a file off of it, but I don't want to have to wait for them to finish doing what they're doing and all that stuff. Well, I can use file sharing. This is so simple to do, and it's really quite simple. All I need to do is on Whatever computer you're on, go to your finder and go ahead and click on, if it's not showing already, make sure the shared section is showing. Now, you do need to turn on file sharing. So let me show you how to do that real quick because I always forget to tell people how to do this. If you go to your system preferences and you go to sharing, you need to make sure screen sharing file sharing and remote login are checked. If they are not, you're not gonna be able to do this and this needs to be done on both computers that you wanna share between. But once you set that, it's good to go for all of your Macs. So once you do that, all of the computers on the same Wi-Fi network will show up. You click on the computer you wanna share with and it's going to connect to that computer. The first time you do this, it will ask you to click connect as. You enter the username and password and bam, you are now logged in to the other computer that you wanted to share files with. So I have a thumb drive in there and I'm gonna go ahead and go over to my laptop and You know, maybe it's on my desktop that I have it. Um, let's see. Maybe it's in download. No. Downloads, no. Oh, here we go. Here are all the photos. Now I want to transfer these photos over to my Mac Pro. Well, it's as simple as drag and drop it where you want it. The process will start copying and you will have transferred the files. Let's do it one more time just in case you missed it because it happens so quickly. I'm going to go ahead and let's see which one I haven't done yet already. Um, uh, okay. I haven't done this Possum Creek. So drag and drop the pictures and the process has started the copying. So that's it for this video guys. I hope this was helpful to someone. I will see you guys in the next video. I'm out of here. Peace.